What's up guys, my name is ESO and welcome to the channel. In this video I'll be showing you where you can get the best unique submachine gun in the game and indeed one of the best guns. I'm also going to be telling you how you can achieve ridiculous damage with this gun, as you can see in the video. Literally following this guy turns survival difficulty into some kind of joke. Now what makes this weapon better than other guns is its unique legendary effect. So every time you hit an enemy it does an additional 15 points of damage and that damage is explosive damage. So if you fire at a group of enemies it does damage to all of them. 15 damage is not a lot though is it? So if you get yourself the demolitions expert perk it actually makes this effect do even more damage. So at max level of the explosives expert perk your explosives will do double damage. So now it's doing 30 damage a shot in a small explosion. On top of that the gun is already doing 34 base damage. However if you have maxed your rifleman perk it will do double damage. So that's 68 damage a shot. And it also has an increased chance to stagger. This means that anything that does not die will be too busy flinching to attack you. But everything will die, I promise you that. So you are doing a total of 98 damage per shot now, but let's not forget that the gun is a submachine gun, and so has the fastest firing rate of any gun in the game, excluding energy weapons and the minigun. It fires just over 2 rounds per second, so you are actually doing a damage per second of 196. And if there are any groups of enemies, you can do even more damage, because you do 60 explosive damage per second. And also, I forgot to mention, but a lot of enemies in the game are actually weak to explosive damage. So they might have a high armour and ignore some of the physical damage your gun does, but then they'll be weak to the explosive damage, so that will completely destroy them. So this gun can really be used in all situations in that sense. So to summarise, this gun wrecks people and it's great versus mobs but also against anything else in the game. Conclusion, this gun is awesome. I haven't even mentioned the bloody mess perk or the fact that it's got a silencer on yet. I mean sneak attacks do double damage, so that's 392 damage a second as long as you're hidden. Let me tell you what this gun is, it's hilarious. The only drawback of this gun is that it makes the game too easy, in my opinion. Obviously there are ways that you can do even more damage, but I'll save those for the build guide. Anyway, to get the spray and pray gun for yourself, there are a few things that we need to do. The guaranteed way to get this gun is to buy it from Cricket, but first we must find Cricket. Cricket is basically a wandering merchant who travels around the commonwealth and can usually be found at random. She does however go to certain locations as part of her routine. I'll leave a list of those locations in the description. For example, she goes to Bunker Hill, Vault 81, Diamond City, and so on. What I did to find her though, was I just went to Vault 81, and I slept in the little shack outside of it. And then every hour after sleeping, I checked to see if she was there. I only had to wait 12 hours in the game, and then she showed up. And when you do find her, just buy the gun from her. It's only 1,300 caps, which is actually amazingly cheap considering how goddamn overpowered it is. I do hope that this video helped you guys out. A lot of testing goes into these videos, and that is part of the reason why I haven't done a top 10 video yet. I'm not going to be rushed into making a shitty top 10 video just for views. I'm going to take my time and make it good. So please do make sure you do subscribe if you are interested in watching that. And you can also check out the other links and you can also check out some other interesting videos in the description and I ESO will see you, loyal subscriber, in the next Fallout 4 video. Have a great day and goodbye.